of the nation is learning about Loyola University for the first time, thanks to its Final Four basketball team. But the school's been around for nearly 150 years, and its students and professors are proud of what goes on in the classroom. CBS 2's Jim Williams was on campus today. Well, my family was a little sad that I wasn't staying home. Home for Bailey Corona is beautiful Laguna Beach, California. How in the world did a young woman from Southern California end up here? I love the people. The city's really cool and love the campus. The Loyola campus, just beyond busy Sheridan Road and Rogers Park, is an oasis. Lush with a blend of old and new buildings along the lakefront. It's definitely one of my favorite places on campus. Moreover, Miguel Luis Molina and other students praise Loyola's small class sizes and the attention they say they get here and at the downtown campus. I've never been in a class with over 30 people, I think. Um, which has been really nice yeah. and very personal. Even though with 16,000 students, Loyola is the largest Jesuit college in the country. Loyola is all about educating the whole person, all different um, disciplines to give us a well-rounded um, personality. Ah! 80 undergrad majors and medical and law schools. Academically, we're an incredible institution. <laughs> More than basketball. But is this basketball success making it easier for you to recruit <laughs> students? Well, it certainly doesn't hurt. Nick Sima, a high school student, visited That'll campus today with his parents. <laughs> so as the basketball success <laughs> made the school even more attractive Oh, for definitely, you. definitely. <laughs> improved. They bumped up a couple spots after that. Maybe one day he'll add to this list. Loyola has lots of prominent graduates. Bob Newhart, former White House Chief of Staff William Daly, Illinois Attorney General Lisa Madigan and Father Michael Flager, just to name a few. Even before the basketball success, the school had its highest enrollments for incoming freshmen in 2016 and 17. Erica, Loyola, we should remind people, has a campus in Rome, too. That's right, and we've seen fans cheering from over there as well for the team. They'll so. be cheering and praying this yes. weekend, I would imagine. Yes, thank you, Jim. All right.